early signs of heat stroke are throbbing headaches and feeling exhausted. If immediate action is not taken, then condition can get worse very quickly. The heart rate increases due to high temperature and a person may feel nausea or have vomiting, have loss of focus or get confused. The temperatures can rise to a very high level of 104 degrees Fahrenheit or 40 degrees Celsius. Our body cannot keep up with such high temperatures. The skin becomes dry, hot and red. The person may have slurred speech, have seizures or may lose consciousness. We need to act fast if anyone shows these signs. Remember, the person suffering may get confused and cannot take care of themselves or tell what happened to them. Watch out for these signs as heat stroke can happen in many different settings. Playing in heat or hot temperatures for a long time and working in hot or humid temperatures for a long time. One common scenario is when children are left inside cars. The temperature inside a car can get 10 degrees hotter than outside and can quickly affect any child left in the car. If someone shows symptoms of heat stroke, you need to act quickly. Do not hesitate to call emergency medical help and start taking steps to cool down the person right away. Get under the shade and move away from the hot environment as soon as possible. Spray the affected person with water or cover them with wet cloths and fan air on them. Move into an air-conditioned area if possible. Drink lots of water or sports drinks to stay hydrated. Take a cool shower to cool down. If you're outdoors, then soaking in cool pond or stream can help bring the temperatures down as well. If the person is getting worse or is unconscious, keep working on cooling their body while waiting for emergency medical help. These steps can save the life of the person and can prevent serious damage to the organs. Here are some practical steps to avoid heat stroke. Wear loose-fitting, lightweight clothes in hot weather. Drink plenty of fluids to stay hydrated. Staying hydrated helps with good blood circulation to the skin and other parts of the body and the body can sweat off to cool down. Never leave children in the car alone. The temperature inside the car can get very high even if the car is in the shade or the windows are open. When outdoors in sun, protect against direct sunlight. Avoid going outside or working outside during the hottest part of the day. If you must have to work outside in hot temperatures, then drink plenty of fluids and take frequent breaks to rest in a cool spot. Oh. If the weather changes quickly with the heat wave, try to take it easy and gradually increase exertion and exposure to heat so your body can adjust to the change. Be extra careful about kids, older people and those with health problems. Remember, protect yourself and help others around you as well.